Hello everyone, greetings. This is Sean back with another shaving video for you all. It's great to see you once again. And today I'm going to feature the six blade disposable razor from Cool Raz. Yes, so here it is, the packaging. Uh, you get two disposable razors per pack. And you get all this for the price of three Canadian dollars from the Canadian retail chain known as Dollarama. And on each razor, you get six blades made from Swedish stainless steel. And here's the back of the packaging in three languages, English, French, and Spanish. And the blade has a high quality rubber handle. And each razor comes with a pivoting head, six blades, and an aloe vera lubricating strip. And there are a couple of warnings here on the packaging. It's a choking hazard with small parts, uh, not intended for individuals under three years. And these razors are not designed to shave scalp or ankles. And these are made in China. And here is the razor itself up close with its uh, rubber grip and pivoting head. And as you can see here, the Pivoting head has six blades with the aloe vera lubricating strip up at the top. And for today's shave, I will use ProRasso Sensitive Skin Shaving Foam. And for the aftershave, I will use the Aftershave Balm from Chella. All right, so let's get into this shave right now. I'm just going to uh, do a pre-rinse with uh, warm water. This will be a three-pass shave and I'll just uh, take the foam there. I'm not going to use a, a pre-shave lotion or gel for um, this video. Um, personally, I think uh, disposable razors were only intended for uh, shaving foams, uh, not uh, traditional uh, shaving creams. So here we go, first pass uh, with the grain. Uh, just uh, I'll take that razor and uh, shave all that uh, hair off uh, my face. Um, I have accumulated two days worth of uh, facial hair growth for the purposes of this uh, video. And um, yeah, right now um, the uh, razor seems to be uh, doing uh, its work. Um, although um, I feel for uh, this particular razor, I have to put in just a little more work than uh, the other kind of uh, disposable razors that um, I uh, got used to in the past. So there we go. Uh, just rinsing my uh, face off once again. Uh, prepping for the second pass, which I will go cross grain. And uh, here we go. Just uh, apply that uh, lather, that foam, once again, all over the contours of my face. I just want to make sure I look uh, handsome for everybody. <laughs> there we go, second pass. And um, Dollarama, it's a uh, Canadian uh, retail uh, store chain. And uh, sometimes I uh, go there to do some shopping. Now. Um, Dollarama, it's for the uh, budget shopper, much like uh, Dollar General is in the uh, United States. And um, you can actually get a lot of uh, cool things from uh, the Dollarama. Um, yeah, it sells anything from uh, cooking supplies, um, snacks, uh, everyday household items. But um, yeah, here we are. Third pass, uh, I'm going to go against the grain. And um, yeah, I don't think um, these razors uh, do such a good job of uh, providing uh, comfort to the skin like uh, other disposable razors. Um, then again, um, these are uh, the kind that are uh, very, very affordable. Uh, I don't think uh, the designers had uh, quality in mind. Um, I think personally uh, 
they just wanted to create a product that would easily sell to uh, make a profit and uh, yeah as a uh, shave against the grain it does feel uh, rather rough I uh, it does seem I do have to do uh, a fair amount of tugging to get uh, the precision and smoothness smoothness that I want I always go for the uh, baby smooth uh, look and feel and so yep just uh, finishing up just doing uh, a cleanup pass and uh, I'll just uh, rinse my face off one last time before applying the uh, aftershave balm and uh, yeah I really look forward to um, sporting a uh, more youthful uh, manly um, just uh, a very clean slick look and so here we go the final touch the uh, aftershave lotion just get it all around over my cheeks mustache chin and neck and bingo all right so overall I think um, this uh, razor was a little bit rough uh, on my uh, skin um, I do notice I did notice that uh, I had to uh, use a, a fair amount of pressure to uh, glide the uh, blade across uh, the cheeks of my face and uh, furthermore uh, this uh, pivoting head it uh, just uh, doesn't uh, rattle as smoothly as uh, some of the other uh, disposable razors out there now um, considering this is a uh, dollar store brand um, you know it just does a very uh, rudimentary job of uh, shaving uh, one's face um, I mean it has six blades I think um, even for a disposable razor that's uh, a little too much for uh, one who uh, who who shaves uh, only with disposable razors uh, on a regular basis I mean uh, the most uh, amount of blades that I would recommend for any uh, shaver who's uh, into disposable razors is three and um, yeah and there's no um, there's no uh, blade up at the uh, top for uh, the tricky areas areas uh, no precision trimmer so um, yeah and um, yeah it uh, may have a very uh, elegant design but to me it kind of feels like a uh, toy so to speak <laughs> um, it doesn't have really have the uh, feel the genuine feel of a uh, disposable razor it doesn't feel very manly in my opinion so um, yeah as for uh, the quality of the shave you know um, it did its job um, but um, there are disposable razors out there that are far more uh, comfortable than this um, I think uh, if I had I not applied uh, the aftershave I would have uh, felt the uh, irritation for um, several hours so um, yeah um, personally I would have to give this uh, razor uh, 5 out of 10 uh, only because uh, of its roughness and uh, just uh, very uh, rudimentary in design and uh, six blades that's a little too much for um, any shaver uh, three blades on a disposable razor that's good enough and um, like I keep saying uh, in my videos the more often one shaves with uh, these kind of razors uh, the more um, prone they are to uh, getting uh, ingrown hairs um, it's just not uh, very good for uh, skin quality that's why I always recommend um, traditional uh, wet shaving um, double-edged safety razors uh, you can't get any better than that uh, just uh, the quality that they provide 
well, do they really smooth out the face? Um, far less irritation. And um, yeah, so. I mean, the razor did its job, don't get me wrong, as I mentioned, but um, I would uh, generally not recommend this product, even if uh, one had to travel. And uh, I'm aware that these kinds of razors were uh, designed for uh, the budget shaver. However, um, even uh, one who's on a tight budget can do uh, much better than... Uh, invest in uh, one of these uh, yeah there are uh, many kinds of uh, affordable disposable razors out there in uh, drug stores uh, pharmacies uh, grocery stores yeah so um, this dollar rama kind the dollar store kind no these would not get a uh, pass from me so just to recap uh, in this video, I uh, featured the uh, Cruel Raz six blade disposable razor. And uh, for the shaving cream, I used uh, ProRasso uh, foam for sensitive skin. And for the aftershave, I used the uh, Chella aftershave balm. So this has been my uh, review of the uh, Cool Raz Six Blade Disposable Razor. I uh, hope that you are satisfied with the uh, presentation uh, given to you today. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. My name is Sean, and I do want to thank you for watching as always. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. And um, peace, much love, namaste, blessings upon you. Be safe and be kind to one another. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care and uh, cheers.